Sadis Naveen Institute of Orthopedic Management. What problem she suffered? I am Jagan Mohan Rao Barsu. Yeah. It is my wife, Suresh Narani. She was suffering from uh, uh, initially neck problem. Mm -hmm. So somebody introduced me to Naveen's uh, orthopedic yeah. yeah. clinic. Yeah. clinic. So we came here uh, around one and a half year back. Yeah. Uh, treatment started. Yeah, we did the manual therapy and uh, she has responded. Yeah. So what? Uh, uh, and she came for knee pains also, right? Yes. So that is later. What, yeah, later on. First leg pain was treated and she got totally relieved. Yes. And after relief also there is a change in BP also. Yeah, and surprisingly. Uh, yeah. She, she is. Uh, and your cardiologist also discarded the medicine. Yes, yes. We are, right. She is not using any medicine for BP. No more BP. No more. And uh, next time you came for knee pains. Yes. Okay. So what uh, symptoms she used to suffer? Yeah. She was unable to stand from, from, the, mm -hmm. from yeah. the floor. Standing, so, stair climbing was also difficult. Stair climbing also. Yeah. also so after our manual therapy treatment, uh, she is now able to stand. Yeah. And there is a stable and also. improvement. Vajrasana. Vajrasana also she is able, able to do. Yeah. And uh, there is considerable X-ray change uh, before manual therapy treatment. Yeah. yeah and after right. manual therapy treatment that I have explained. Yes. Yes. That I will attach uh, to this video later on. Okay. Uh, thank you very much. Uh, this is the pre-treatment x-ray of a Rani patient. Here uh, you can see clearly the medial joint space is decreased. Uh, upon spring test diagnosis, it is revealed that uh, proximal tibia externally rotated and laterally shifted. That means internal rotation, medial glide was lost. That leads to uh, proximal tibia tilt medially that leads to compression of the medial joint space that again leads to the weight bearing axis shifting to medial joint compartment so accordingly we died we designed the manual therapy treatment and we treated her after post treatment you can see clearly there is a medial joint space increased we restored internal rotation, medial glide that has um, uh, corrected the medial tilt of the proximal tibia and the weight bearing axis has shifted to center of the knee joint. So take home point, point, point from this uh, uh, analysis is the arthritis patients that is especially medial knee arthritis the cartilage is temporarily compressed rather than wearing out because of the medial tilt. Once we correct the tilt, automatically joint space is restoring from this pre and post treatment x-ray analysis. Another uh, basic question people ask is the, uh, what about the synovial fluid? Synovial fluid also restores because, because of the initial uh, stage of arthritis or the severe stage of arthritis because of the pain and loss of range uh, we lose uh, we won't use the moment when moment is lost the pressure gradient inside the joint is lost that leads to the hampering of the influx outflux mechanism of synovial fluid which is secreted from the synovial membrane surrounding the joint once we realign the joint, we decrease the pain, we increase the range of motion, influx, outflux of uh, the synovial fluid takes place. So these two take home points will uh, say that 
a arthritis medial knee arthritis can be diagnosed uh, early and can be properly reversed with manual therapy thank you